going to be nervous for. It's another basketball game. You know, it's a winner go home. Um, playing against a really good team, a, cha a team that was in the finals last year. Um, but we're home and we have to take care of business at home. I think it was an experimental thing. Um, I don't think that's going to be something we can we go with. But if we do, hey, we're going to roll with it. I mean, it's a coach's type of decision, and like I said, we we always going to be in, we're all on the same page. If he decides, if the coach decides to do it, we'll figure it out and figure out how to play with it. Good math. It's good math. It's a good math. Good math. Um, so, I mean, uh, what's the thing with you guys? Uh, <laughs> um, well, we're trying to, we, we put ourselves in this position two series before, but not winning at home the first games. And, you know, now we kind of did the same thing by losing the first two on the road. Uh, it just says, you know, it, it doesn't say much. It just says, you know, we, we're going to fight to the end. Um, if it, it, We're never going to give in or just give up. Say, oh, okay, but you know, we've been fighting. It's been all season for us. When you look at the tape, you guys talk about game plan. What do you notice about the difference? How they are more willing to shoot three and settle for that period? Uh, I think we did a better job in those two games of protecting the paint, and they were, you know, there was kind of shots they were given, not given, but um, that they were executing and getting, you know, getting those shots by. A, you know, swinging the ball, making the right passes. Um, you know, we were just more, I think, I think, paint protective at home than we were on the road. Sorry, you asked about this yesterday, but being named uh, third team All NBA, from where you were four years ago when you got first got here, how do you kind of? Um, I'll look at all the individual accolades after the season's over. Um, right now, I, I just like my. This is all my teammates and my coaches and organization. This is a, a group award to, to me. And, you know, but at the end of the day, I'll look at it after everything's said and done. Um, great accomplishment for our, our organization, our team, and my teammates. I thank them. 20th game of the playoffs for you guys tonight, 102 in the season now. How much the work you put in over the summer, how much has that helped you get through this grinding? Can you imagine have, having gone through this long of a season previous to this year? I feel great. Uh, before the season, I don't know. I never had the opportunity, but right now I feel great. I mean, I really feel fantastically. Uh, I don't, I'm not ready to take a break. I feel good enough to keep going and going and going, and um, uh, that's the work that I've put in and my teammates have put in to be able to make sure that their bodies will be able to uphold at this situation at this point of the year. I'm just, I'm just living every day, every hour, every minute. I didn't play. I played bad. I played good. I didn't play bad and play good. I'm just living, <laughs> living for the day and enjoying it. I, like I said, it's May. What? Anybody got the date? Twenty something. And we're still playing. I'm still talking to you guys. I mean, I'm happy. I'm, I'm glad to be in this position. Um, not down three two, but just to be in this position to be able to still talk to you guys and and, and be here and and and. Playing basketball. Uh, I mean, is it too early to try to reflect on what you may have learned or things you didn't know about after playing playing basketball? Uh, that's one of the things where I'll sit back after the season and really calculate it and make some notes and, and chill and, and think about it. And um, that's one of those things I'll do after the season also. Anything so far that's just kind of surprised you like that? Uh, don't lose game ones. <laughs> <laughs> Seriously, I'm not even joking. That's really truthful. Like, don't lose game ones. Yeah. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Man, period, period. Kyle, Kenny probably was saying that you guys play faster at home. I agree. Yeah. I agree. That's simple. Sorry to cut your question off. I agree. There was, was another part to that? Well, just, oh, well, I agree. Uh, I don't know. I, we just most teams do. A lot of teams do that uh, in the NBA. Um, I, I can name a few off the top of my head, but a lot of teams just play extremely faster at home and more confident at home. And um, I don't know what it is. It's the energy, maybe uh, more comfortability. But um, I think when we at our best throughout the season, we always play the same pace throughout a whole game. And that's you know one of the things we can go back and look at.
I don't play football. Oh, that's a pretty question. How you know? Uh, always things are different on the road. It's just, you know, the crowd, the the, the communication is a little bit tougher. You got to get better hand signals. And, you know, as football, they got great hand signals, signs and everything, you know, because it's so loud. But um, that's some things, you know, we, we've learned and got to look at and see where we can get better at. Uh, it looks, I mean, he played well offensively. You know, he can be a little bit better defensively, but his ankle – it hurts, but um, I'm, he's not making any excuses. I'm not making any excuses for him. He, we're ready to go. He's on that floor. He's ready to go. He's going to have the same um, commitment to the team as everyone else. Do you think he could be important to uh, helping out of those traffic? Yeah. I mean, you know, when they did it a few times, and I, I, me and him did a pick and roll. I think it was three out of four times we kind of got a basket on it. Um, so, you know, with a big body like that and a guy who can finish high, catch high, and be seven feet, but with the seven set, whatever his wingspan is, taking layups, um, is always going to be helpful. You just said you play faster at home. Can you play faster at home with Davey on the court? You got no choice. You got to keep up. You may have to pay him two minute increments, but you know you got to keep up. <laughs> but you know, but that's the thing about him is even if in our offense, if we play fast, we get down the court. If he's trailing, you can set a screen and he can roll. Or you know, sometimes we can even catch our breath by throwing it into him. So it's always a good. It's a good thing to have him playing.